Welcome to In5. In this channel, we're gonna make contents in different categories in 5 minutes. And today, we count down top 10 best free games in our opinion. So, let's go. Number 10. Brawlhalla. Brawlhalla has 4 players fighting each other out of a small area. While many of the characters share similar moves, every fighter has a unique set of cosmetics and every week you have access to a new rotating selection of fighters. Number 9. Paladins At first it had a lot of controversy due to it being an Overwatch clone, but over the years it gained its own identity with more heroes and diverse multiplayer modes. On the surface Paladins is a hero shooter but within its layers lies an in-depth skill system where you customize your champion's abilities. Number 8. Splitgate Arena Warfare Mixing portal mechanic and Unreal Tournament blistering action, Splitgate Arena Warfare offers a brand new experience to first-person arena combat with more options and strategies to choose from. Its accessibility is built for both veterans and first-time FPS players. Number 7. Call of Duty Warzone Activision has finally put out a free battle royale for Call of Duty and it's just as fun as Black Ops 4's blackout mode. Warzone puts you in a team of 3 taking on dozens of others to either be the last team standing or if you are playing plunder mode, grab as much cash before the time runs out. Number 6. Path of Exile Path of Exile is an action RPG where players can explore massive dungeons and battle fierce monsters. Of course there's plenty more to do than just mindless murder and exploration. You can talk to other players and encampments or compete in one of the many leagues available with more than 5 million players registered. You may find yourself a new group of friends to hang out with during these troubling times. Number 5. World of Tanks Ever wanted to get in a tank and blow something sky high? Well you can in World of Tanks. World of Tanks is a bit tougher than most shooters and military games. Players must strategize and make the most of their shots to take down enemies quickly, whether by deploying ambush or shooting at threats to immobilize targets. Number 4. Gwent, The Witcher Card Game CD Projekt Red is not only busy with their upcoming Cyberpunk 2077, they are also working very hard on their standalone version of The Witcher 3's favorite minigame, Gwent. This card game is different from the minigame version, instead this is purely built for a long-term service with a growing eSport league. It's also available on iOS and Android. Number 3. Apex Legends Suppose you want a shooter that gives you more options in traversing the battlefield or features a colorful cast of characters. If that sounds like you, Apex Legends might be well worth your time. You and two other players take the role of various characters and must be the last team standing. Sounds like every other battle royale game. But Apex Legends manages to distinguish itself by granting each character different abilities. Number 2. The Awesome Adventures of Captain Spirit Top Games isn't a massive MMORPG or a hero-based shooter. It's a simple, story-driven adventure from the makers of the critically acclaimed Life is Strange. Don't Not Entertainment's free prequel demo to Life is Strange 2 is a short, somber and sympathetic experience. Number 1. Destiny 2 Destiny 2 was a $60 game, but as September 2019, it's free to play. In case you've never played or heard of Destiny, you take the role of a guardian and must bring down the evil Red Legion. Along the way you find new armors and weapons that will fit you up alone to take on tougher enemies. Thank you for watching. If you like more 5 minute contents, subscribe to our channel.